Right, down here at AIS today, we've got this sneaky little midweek install we thought you'd give you a quick run to. It's um, a nice little job. We've already been in and had the rival bar and a heap of stuff fitted up on the front, but he did add, a, add some uh, perception uh, panoptic uh, driving lights on the front this time around, which has really set the front off nicely. Uh, the other thing we did is a lithium battery system, uh, some specialised lighting. So come on through here and I'll show you some of that. First of all, on his RSI canopy, we were able to install some uh, of our Irwin LED lights there, uh, orange and white, as per, you've probably seen on some of my videos, very popular. Uh, we've also popped in some perception uh, work lights there on each corner, which is activated from a switch on the inside. So that's all come up very nice. He's got three lights on the doors and one on the inside. Um, it's a metre strip on the back, which just fitted in really well, on, particularly on the RSI canopy, so that's worked very nice. We opened the back, uh, a couple of things here, customers brought off us a Bushman original fridge, fridge. it's uh, 32 to 52 litres with the extendable top, fantastic little fridge, great current consumption, um, we've just tied that down with some RV storage straps there and that's a great little bit of gear. The Red Arc 1000 watt inverter we've tucked down the side there um, and we've also got the power distribution box just in the front there with your cigarette lighter plugs and voltage readout. So we are a bit limited on space for the battery so we have a special spot that we do a lot of the lithium batteries in the Amarok and that's behind the back seat. 110 amp hour lithium Bain Tech battery. Victron Smart Shunt and a Victron Solar Regulator all sneaked in there on the uh, Check your plate panel, uh, just hides it all the way there. Uh, that battery is only 13 kilos, so nice and light. Uh, we also, he supplied an ARB compressor that we wanted to slip in there, and that's worked fine and uh, got him behind the back seat as well. If you pop around to the front, you can see the custom Amarok switches we've utilised um, for the side lights on the canopy and the compressor, which is all controlled there. Factory style driving light switch as well, which is really neat. Um, and all in all, it's uh, come up really nice. This is our everyday sort of stuff here at OS. So uh, get on the website, get on the YouTube, check out all our stuff. Keen to see us. Bye.